workouts, and helpful advice. Add this video to your favorites. It will guide you when you train. Next exercise, squat plus sidestep. Go. If you can't do it, try bending less your legs and taking smaller steps. Don't bend your back. Keep your abs constantly tight to stabilize the spine. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards. Keep them constantly in line with your toes. Be sure not to exceed the tip of the foot with the knee. Don't lift your heel. Keep your foot constantly well rested. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Stop. Next exercise, squat plus butt kicks. 3, 2, 1. Go. If you are unable to complete this movement, bend your legs less. Do not shift your body weight onto the tips of your feet. In order to maximize the effectiveness of the exercise, the force should be placed onto the heels. Don't pass the line of your toes with your knees during the descent to avoid joint problems. Don't curve your back during this exercise. Keep your abs and glutes constantly tight. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards during the descent phase. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Stop. Next exercise, dumbbell squat plus sidestep. Go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't bend your back. Keep your abs constantly tight to stabilize the spine. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards. Keep them constantly in line with your toes. Be sure not to exceed the tip of the foot with the knee. Don't lift your heel. Keep your foot constantly well rested. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, dumbbell back cross lunges. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't place the knee of the back leg on the floor to avoid decreasing the effectiveness of the exercise. Don't exceed your toes with the front knee to avoid joint problems. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't bend or curve your back. Keep your abs constantly tight. Keep your abs and butt constantly tight for a better balance. Don't lift your heel off the floor. 
Constantly keep your foot in position. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, dumbbell squat plus butt kicks. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Do not shift your body weight onto the tips of your feet. In order to maximize the effectiveness of the exercise, the force should be placed onto the heels. Don't pass the line of your toes with your knees during the descent to avoid joint problems. Don't curve your back during this exercise. Keep your abs and glutes constantly tight. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards during the descent phase. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, dumbbell squat plus back cross lunges. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Don't exceed the tip of your foot with your knee during the lunges and squats. Don't touch the floor with the knee of the back leg during lunges. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Keep your abs and butt constantly tight to stabilize the spine and prevent injuries. Don't bend or curve your back by keeping your abs constantly tight. Don't bend your head. Try staring at a fixed point in front of you. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, dumbbell side lunges. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Be sure not to bend your torso sideways. Your back should always be perfectly straight. Never exceed the tip of your foot with the knee to avoid damaging the joints. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Keep your abs constantly tight during the exercise to improve balance. Be sure not to bend the outstretched leg.
For a better balance, try stretching your arms forward. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, dumbbell deadlift. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Keep the abdomen constantly tight to stabilize the spine and avoid injuries. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, dumbbell pulsed frog squat. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Never exceed the tip of the foot with the knee on the way down. Do slow and controlled movements to prevent joint problems. Don't curve your back. Try keeping your abs constantly tight. Don't curve your neck forward. Try staring at a fixed point in front of you. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, dumbbell foot lifts. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. Never put your butt on the ground during descent in order to keep the contraction constant. Be sure not to raise your shoulder blades off the floor during the exercise. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Water break. Three, two, one, go. Next exercise, single leg sumo squat. Three, two, one, go. 
If you are unable to perform the squats with this movement, rest both feet on the ground instead of lifting one. Be sure not to raise your heels off the floor. Don't bend or arc your back. Keep it constantly straight to avoid problems. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Keep your abs tight throughout the workout. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards. Always keep them in line with your feet. Never exceed the tip of your foot with the knee to avoid damaging the joints. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, squat plus hip extension. Three, two, one, go. If you are unable to complete this movement, bend your legs less. When you are performing the descent, be sure not to exceed your toes with your knees. Do not curve your back while performing the exercise. To be able to correctly do this, maintain the abdominals and the glutes well contracted. During the descent, do not bend the legs inwardly or outwardly. The knees should always be in line with your feet. Don't lift your heel off the ground during descent. Keep your foot constantly well placed. Don't bend your head. Try staring at a fixed point in front of you. Move slowly during both the descent phase and the ascent to increase the effectiveness of the exercise. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, donkey kicks extended leg. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try the donkey kicks with your legs bent at 90 degrees. Be sure not to curve your back during the movement. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't strain your neck. Try staring at a fixed point on the floor. Don't stretch out the foot, keep it constantly flexed. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, pulse donkey kicks with leg at 90 degrees. Three, two, one. Go. 
If you can't do it, try smoothly raising and lowering the leg, creating a wider movement. Be sure not to curve your back during the movement. Keep your foot flexed and your leg at 90 degrees for optimal muscle work. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't turn your hips laterally. Your back must always be very straight. Don't lift your head. Your neck should be in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point on the floor. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, donkey kicks plus hip abduction on all floors. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. Be sure not to rotate the pelvis when you lift the leg to not strain your back. Don't put your knee on the ground when you take down the leg. Keep the contraction constant. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't bend or curve your back. Keep your torso parallel to the ground. Don't lift your head. Your neck should remain in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point on the floor. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise circles with leg on all fours. Three, two, one. Go. If you can't do it, try moving your leg up and down instead of moving it in a circular motion. Don't bend or curve your back. Always keep your torso parallel to the floor. Don't turn your hips in order to avoid back problems. Five, four, Three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Your 
your neck should be in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point on the floor to help you. Try to keep the leg and foot constantly outstretched. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, pelvis rotation. Three, two, one. Go. If you can't do it, try doing regular butt lifts. Perform the movement slowly and keep your abs tight to avoid problems. Be sure not to lift your shoulders off the floor during the exercise. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Water break. Three, two, one. Go. Next exercise stretching quadriceps. Three, two, one, go. Don't force the push. Stop when you've reached the limit. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise stretching buttocks. Go.
five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, spine stretching. Go. Make sure not to lift the lower back during the entire exercise. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Try out our full workout plans. More info in the description below.